implementing asynchronous apex in salesforce can be done using these four approaches future methods giveable apex batch apex and schedule apex future method is the most basic way of implementing asynchronous apex we just need to define this method like any other method and call it from the main apex code queuable apex is similar to future methods however comes with some additional capabilities using a queuable apex we can call another queuable apex to form a chain of asynchronous apex executions this is helpful in scenarios where we expect the apex code to execute serially in an exact sequence batch apex is completely different from future and queuable as it is used mainly for bulk operations like performing dml operations on hundreds of thousands of records or making bulk external web service callouts scheduled apex is the simplest of all in terms of implementation and execution this allows us to execute our apex code exactly at a particular date and time also we can schedule our apex code to execute repetitively to accomplish recurring tasks such as sending out monthly newsletters or reminders about subscription expiration